right, let's move on. We're going to talk about custom commands. Now, custom commands allow you to easily create documents, letters, blocks of text, pictures. It automates repetitive tasks for us. So have you ever, during your dictation, you're always saying the same thing, and uh, you feel like you're repeating that a lot? Well, you can create macros for all that stuff. So I'm going to show you some more dictation now. And in this next set of dictation, I'm going to include some macros. After all, I'll explain to you what they were and uh, all that fun stuff. Delete document. Medical header. September 4th, 2009. New paragraph. Tracy Miller. New line. Dear Dr. Miller, colon, new line. Patty Dempsey is a pleasant 26-year-old white female who is here today for injuries she has sustained in a motor vehicle accident, which occurred on September 20, 2008 period. The patient states that she was the driver of a 2006 Mercedes-Benz when she was rear-ended by a speeding car in Austin, Texas, period. The patient states that the ambulance did not arrive to the scene, nor did she go to the hospital, period. However, a week later, she followed up with Dr. Christopher Fox, whom she is finding great benefit from. New line. The patient currently has occasional ridiculous symptoms affecting the lower right extremities, period. The cardiomediastinal silhouette is unremarkable for an AP film with no marked cardiomegaly, period. Both oblique and lateral views were taken today of the patient's right knee. There were no benign masses indicated, no microcalcifications noted, period. The patient is to return in two weeks for a follow-up visit. New line. Medical signature. Okay, so for a minute here, I'm going to zoom out because I want you to see that we just created a document in under a minute, which includes the full header information. All right, that's a macro. That's what I was talking about. When I said Dr. Miller or Tracy Miller, it put all of the, the, the person's name, their address, all that. And then finally, the last one I did was a, a medical signature, you know, so I don't have to worry about that. So now we can zoom back in so you can check out the accuracy. So macros speeds up our work because, it's again, it's allowing us to insert the stuff that we're, we're constantly dictating. We no longer have to do that. Now, of course, you still have all the playback options, all the editing options, all the formatting options that we just talked about. Well, that type of macro that I just did is called the text and graphic macro. Those are very easy to create. Um, let's move on.